Hello and welcome to your collective love reading for singles and couples. So let's have a look at what the mirrors a love oracle has for you today. All right, this one kind of fumbled spiritual growth for those of you who are single. I feel that you're very focused on your spirituality. Past love, perhaps trying to get through past heartache and grief. Maybe you're still in contact with someone from your past. There you go, past life, past love and past life. Strong vibes there. Now this is a collective reading for all zodiac signs. So yes, there will be other videos different zodiac signs that are the same because it is a collective reading however trust that you were brought to this video because um, there is a message for you your angels and guides have guided you here so that you hear something or see something in the symbology I am a channel so I channel spirits messages for you now spiritual growth you're focused on your spirituality this is somebody that you may have a romantic connection with maybe a water sign cancer pisces or a scorpio however it doesn't have to be it can just be someone that is showing romantic interest in you now for those of you in a relationship what i'm getting here is that your person is um, trying to open up more spirituality in your relationship possibly um, going to yoga together doing meditation together tantra or something that is going to open up um, both of you to a strong spiritual vibe um, incorporated in your relationship so that's really interesting one for the couples now for the singles it's just about focusing on your spirituality you may connect with someone who is on the same wavelength to you um, this is someone that's coming in with you know our romantic intentions past love and we're basically saying stand back basically get away <laughs> to our past it's like i don't want to be hurt i don't want to go through that again this is about almost feeling persecuted by our past okay like it's just been too much i don't want to go through that again and i definitely want nothing to do with the past again so even if they come back knocking saying take me back you'll be like standing your ground saying no so that is what that is saying past life wow um karmic finances basically so you have past life karma that's going to help you financially in this life which is really nice to know um so it's almost like your past life is now um karmically clear if you've been going through financial difficulties or challenges, things, portals and gateways are opening up in this lifetime that are going to assist you forward financially, which is really, really nice to know. All right, let's have a look what the Gypsy Oracle have to say in regards to this. Tell me about Knight of Cups waiting. There may be somebody waiting for you okay waiting for you to take notice may, waiting for you to say yes to them okay um so you may be also waiting for your romeo or your juliet to show up perhaps you've been using your spirituality law of attraction um to bring this special person in waiting for this now for those of you in a relationship you may have been waiting for your person to catch up with your spirituality um, to actually say hey i'm really interested in what you're doing or what you're watching or what you're into or your spirituality teach me or show me or let's do this together and you've been waiting for that connection to take place 
um, gift. So your past may be coming back saying, you know, this and that, trying to make offers, especially if you're single. And um, that is the gift. It's an opportunity that's being presented to you. Sometimes gift indicates um, a holiday or an event where gifts are being given like a birthday thanksgiving christmas easter that kind of thing so perhaps there was a significant event between you and your past like an ex um, that happened around that time like um, for instance easter something may have happened um, between you and someone from your past that you were romantically connected with or Christmas, Thanksgiving, a birthday, or something along those lines, and it it's kind of traumatized you. Um, now, for those of you in a relationship, this may very well be, um, you know, with past love and this, your person, your current partner may be bringing this up, or um, you're trying to heal doing a bit of regression um, or hypnotherapy or meditation to heal any traumas from your past so that your current relationship can progress. Now, joyfulness, this is a celebration, feeling really good and happy in regards to some money that's finally flowing in this lifetime because we've cleared off some karmic debts from our past life. Um, so this is really, really, really positive. I've got a really good vibe to do with that. So let's go ahead and see what my Finder Sequel Kipper and Lenormand Mix have as well in regards to love for my couples and singles. We have another city, suburb, official news. This could also be legalities in some cases could also be a foreign city okay um you know it, it kind of reminds me of paris for some reason and i'm in queensland australia so paris to me is like a foreign land and it's romantic and it's it's like a daydream to be walking along the streets of paris like breakfast at tiffany's so that's kind of the vibe i get with this sometimes and you know i certainly do feel that now for those of you who are single now for those of you who are in a relationship this could be official as in making your relationship official like let's go exclusive or let's move in let's sign a few contracts together merge our bills or our bank accounts or um, let's literally get married or let's um, you know sign a lease together get a mortgage or something along those lines it's about making something official now sometimes the tower does indicate work okay it, it could also be saying that you live in an apartment block i need to see what other cards come out with it okay so this could be an ex and there are le legal dealings with an ex because mature woman with um the tower it kind of gives me vibes of someone that's from the past returning and there's legalities involved for some of you i'll keep going um and so there is an attractive offer now this lady is actually very attractive because the bouquet is next to her. Very attractive, very mild-mannered, very kind-hearted, very generous and, and caring. She's just got all the grace and all the, all the nice qualities of a female. Okay, she may even be a sister or a friend. So if it's not legalities, it could be someone that you work with if you're the masculine. And if you're the feminine, a masculine may be thinking of you like that at work. Um, or, you know, um, they're thinking of asking you out. You've got forget-me-nots in between tulips. Tulips are the language of intimacy and passion. And forget-me-nots, literally, they can't forget you. They're thinking of you non-stop. Loyalty and um, guidance. Now, 
loyalty and guidance is like a best friend someone that you can talk to and someone that you can trust so if you're already in a relationship this could be you and your person have that closeness to each other um, now this kind of throws me off but it also gives me the vibe that maybe your person is planning a holiday really wants to take you out and to enjoy time with you uh, with the cross a spiritual connection cross is also a card of destiny there we go the courthouse again with the bear the courthouse doesn't actually mean um, legalities unless there are supportive legal cards around it and there are none besides the tower but that is more of a workplace or official news if there is another messenger card but there's no messenger cards with it so it's more along the lines of uh, maybe someone that you work with someone in the same apartment building maybe your person wants to invite you to their place or it could very well be um so, you know a very attractive city a very beautiful building and this person lives there so we have loyalty very close supportive um, connection destined karmic could be but i feel more along the lines of you know karma is clear um, and so this is probably more along the lines of destiny courthouse and the bear is a big courthouse like a major big city courthouse it's because the bear it gives a large size to something okay so you know for those of you dealing with a online love situation uh, your person may still be going through a separation because they've got despair a big court situation and conflict online is a, a huge issue so um, victory pre prevails with this marriage so if you are struggling to make um, this relationship work it's saying that your connection will be victorious the, your, your love is going to be a success things are going to work out according to this reading um, especially if it's online but the stars and the the cross give it a strong spiritual connection as well as destined connection much like soulmates or even twin flames it's a very big court situation court conflict that your person is in despair about and it's causing them even health issues perhaps however this um, son is saying that um your person you know and you are going to have a successful um, union that you know you're going to be very stable as well so it looks good in the outcome for those of you going through this okay now let's go ahead and get some personalized messages shall we and don't forget to click like if you like this reading and subscribe be part of the dark light family i'd love to have you on board and if you already have subscribed thank you so much i appreciate your love and your support somebody wants to say stay tonight please oh. and then we have uh, they know it'll never happen but they still want you Ooh, who's that if only you knew how i feel i'll wait for you forever if i have to someone thinks you're very special i love you more than her or him Ooh. Um, when i see you the world shakes around me and angels have guided you to meet now it's up to you 
Well, some very specific personal messages there. I know that some of these will be for some of you. And there's a message for everyone in my reading. So I know everyone got something. And I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, I send you love, peace and light. Bye for now.